Hey, bye. Welcome back to my Black Lightning review. This is Stubby Season 3, Episode 10. We see that Jennifer is like bonding from this her own. She's like bonding, but not really like. And she's but at the same time she feels that she's in her safe place, and then she wants back to she's appears back in in this apartment in the balcony, and then Jefferson is returns back to Freeland from crisis sake from crisis and he's trying to call that Gabby and Gabby and there's no signal in it. Any powers to use to open a force field so you can go into Freeland. So Jennifer feels guilty that she is working for Odell or she is she done with the suit and she and she talks to her dad she's she says that she wants to kill Odell and um, it's really interesting seeing that um Black Lightning he feels that he looks at her right and that he's it feels like he's okay with that. Okay with that. He's not. He's not saying no to the point. No, I did not. Have. He's saying he has a good at uh, one at a time with the drug. But I'm surprised that he did it already. He says, Are you crazy, Jennifer? Why didn't you? Why didn't you let anything not kill anyone? Why didn't you let it stop back then? But it seems like I feel like Jefferson is okay with But they'll be wrong. I feel like on top of that, he's, he'll be okay. I mean, that he'll be okay with Right, these time for power some more to throw up on Ashton, throw up power some more day. Find out that Anissa and Lynn and Gabby they have no idea what happened. At all because they not they have no idea but the red stars or any of them just in the period I think. They only know about um they don't even know about I don't think they know about Jennifer um her powers choose at on table or choose it. She was seeing the other realities of the other Jennifer's, but now Jennifer doesn't. She has no idea about the actual crisis, but she only remembers of herself seeing the reality, the other realities. But Jennifer, Jefferson knows everything. He knows what happened. All that stuff. The ASA is pretty much going down hell now. Major Gray and what they all talk to each other about how much how Jennifer is not pure communicating. How much Jennifer is now communicating with anyone in, in the ASA and Odell and such. And they try to find a way to track her and kill her, and, which is not a word at all. Just the, like, literally using their own. They're pretty much. Odell is pretty much shooting himself in the foot. You really think about it. So. Jennifer finds her mom because Black Lightning told her to find her mom, which she goes to the lab and such. And Jennifer steals her mom and she drops this camera to clean thing, this glass of camera to clean up free light. And oh, that's all she had in her. It's so crazy how much Lynn has been throughout this, this before. Lynn needs to rest and she needs to relax. And not that so overwhelmed with dreams and light and such as it's obvious that her character is like has a digital to relight and such so I really hope you know Jefferson and the kids help Lynn out helping her out just having her relax and her shirt is a print so maybe she's maybe she was experimenting with things and things like cause that's an old one Mode, so maybe that's why I'm sure the flow shows black. That guy, the TC, who, um, Gabby, who knows Gabby, he, he somehow goes into um, the Taylor, which is which really is the HQ of where Gabby operates. Gabby operates, so 
He finds the player with an Alistar villain. He Gabby meets him and then they speak about how much Bruce are talking to him and such that Gabby is located here just there. No sense TV is a matter he is afraid of the Koreans might find him and such. So he's trying to hide out pretty much. So which Gabby lets him do so. And then somehow he he sees his tech to talk to the computer and such. And he finds out that Gabby was technically is technically dead because of that episode back then where I think in season two or so. I think that's what it was, where uh, he was, I put an uh, kill order on Gambi and we're gonna find out who that traitor is, I'll tell you who it is, but it's really interesting, and throughout the episode we see um, Jefferson and Vanessa talking to each other about um, how to lead and such, she, um, Henderson wants one them to talk, please help with like the man creates a house building and such and this uh, feels like her dad's not listening because she just jumps in sitting in charge of everything and such so and this uh, and black honey they talk to each other about the, the daughter wants to be listened to her own father and such and he does he listens to her Great. In the middle of our, in the middle of all this, we did an earthquake, but not really. With Brandon, character Brandon was pretty much um, checking Freeland and Jennifer knew she knew she knew what to she did to Lynch. So then give something to Jennifer to give to Brandon. Jennifer saved Brandon's life, so that was really great and such. Jennifer and Brandon to try to lie and such. They have this network of women. They did transport us back to the AC. On the way there, they Jennifer uses her powers and to break freedom that was um, major great talk to talk to her about. I'm trying to find a way to kill Jennifer and such and the doctor that daughter in, in the AC kills a, a ship in the back of somebody's um His neck and he tries to kill Jennifer. So there are these two drivers, and one of them has a ship to push, kill Jennifer, and the other guy stops him because he feels like there was something suspicious of him throughout the entire car ride and such. And which there is, and Jennifer and Brennan escape. And then we see that Lynn just goes back to the house and about half of the she was there for, but she was back in the house and she was trying to. Oh yeah, she was trying to find some green light. She had eleven house and Jefferson sees her and then she gets so mad at Jefferson starts hitting him and such and then tries to tries to run after her and then she she leaves the house and then Jefferson just falls downstairs and then Henderson calls calls him and says that he needs help as soon as possible. So we see uh, that Jefferson and and the they over the day help Henderson out and do this mission where they help these Mahiman kids kids escape and we see that Black Honey Honey listens to her daughter and then we see that's actually really amazing that he actually listens to to the kid and she's getting everyone she's cleaning the whistle seems really well and she's doing what she believes in doing that's what we often see I mean like love to see stuff like that in, in these summer shows and we see them we see both of them like stable with the men he makes it's really great so TC finds black like, honey in those suits and they and Gary wants to make sure that TC doesn't tell anyone 
I bought that, bought that and also you got PC stay upstairs and um, his apartment and the search and they find out that um, he, TC's um, touch uses a computer but that's he finds out who actually killed Game Beat Search and because Jamie couldn't officially find out why because there was a bit twin involved in search but uh, TC is able to find out Used the uh, the computer software research and find out that Lady Eve was the one who put a hit on Gabby. And if you guys don't know, Lady Eve was this character from season one. She was killed off and such. So it made this really interesting scene. Is, is she back or was she, did she put a hit, hit out on him back then before she was killed off and such? That character to that character isn't really dead and. Can't be in serious trouble and such, which is I think this, I think if you've seen this episode, shows, I feel like her character could be back from dead and such. It's gonna be interesting to know how and why and such and why can't be particularly and all this stuff. But I love that in this episode that we see um, a necessarily leader with her since she really cares about seeing feel and I love seeing how Jennifer really. So to protect Brandon and such, she tried all this, and we see that speaking of um, Jennifer, she sees Odell and she tries to, she immediately want, wants to kill him, and she just, tr she tries to, but with a hologram, I feel like, I really wish that wasn't the case, I really wish that wasn't a hologram at all, you know, just I feel like it's a little bit hard to do, so, yeah, what do you think, what of you take about this episode of like planning, let me know how many people love what's the main thing we love doing, what's the main thing we hope to see happen in the next few episodes of the show. What do you guys think about like, Lynn? What do you guys think? She'll be able to, able, able to relax and such because I feel like she needs to really relax and such. So I really hope that she does get to help the family just to save her before she gets. Because it's more, because she really causes harm to some and such. Watch that new episode of the podcast I posted yesterday and see the, and catch up to the Black Planet movies. If you haven't yet, I'll see you soon.